Today, I want to try and make a piece of music based off of Greek mythology. Why are we doing this? Well, it's just like a fun songwriting challenge. I'm going to see if I can grow and stretch myself as a musician and a songwriter and a bass player by finding inspiration from something from the past. So let's see what happens. I think I'm going to go with the Minotaur. If you remember, the Minotaur is half man, half bull. He's sort of this monster that lives in this maze and he kills anyone that enters the maze. And in the story, the Minotaur is actually uh, killed by Theseus, who uh, the way he gets out of the maze after he kills the Minotaur is he has a ball of yarn where he's been leaving a string behind him so he can find how to get out of the maze once he's defeated the Minotaur. So super cool story. Um, I think there's some kind of cool musical Bible we can come up with here. So I think this is from Theseus's perspective where he is in the maze, he's not in his element, but he has a plan to defeat the monster. So the feeling of being in the maze and trying to hunt and kill the Minotaur and escape using the yarn. I think this is Theseus's, the energy Theseus is feeling while he's in the maze. So I wanna have, yeah, like frantic, focused sort of vibe, uh, dark, some dissonance, some tension, some spookiness. Uh, and then maybe we could try and come up with something that will also represent the thread that can save you and lead you out if you can defeat the monster. So, yeah, let's see what I can come up with. So that's the Minotaur and Theseus reimagined as a lo-fi breakbeat funk groove. Um, let me know if you like this kind of video, these, these tiny songs, these creative sort of videos. I really enjoy making them and they're fun for me to, to stretch myself creatively and challenge myself and try and think about music in different ways. Hopefully it's helpful or just entertaining for you. So let me know if you want more of this kind of video. Um, and it's just a reminder too that music is everywhere. Even in a story that's 3,000 years old, you never know where you're going to find creativity or inspiration. So I encourage you to uh, stretch yourself this week and try and come up with some music from an unexpected place. Um, also, if you want a resource on how to specifically be creative with bass, I do have a resource that might be helpful for you uh, on, on how to play bass and how to come up with bass lines. And the link to that is in the description. Um, so thanks for hanging out this week and I'll see you on the next video.